Hi there, I'm Liam Lynch. I've been working with the core band of this group for about 20 years now, uh, photographing the different forms and groups that make part of the larger collective. And in the last five years, I've been shooting these particular shows on Fuji cameras and eventually set myself up with a X-Pro3. Uh, working in this kind of environment suits me, less chimping and whatnot, not worrying about the screen. But testing the X100V was actually quite a nice setup, especially with the small size of the stage and being able to flip the screen down, and shoot without breaking my neck. Uh, but switching between the two, seeing the different capabilities and setting one up to allow for tracking focus and the other just to shoot manually, because I tend not to work with any auto exposure or whatnot. And the nice thing about the cameras is they have a tendency to feel like when I used to work with film cameras or Leicas, and yet the capabilities that they have as digital cameras are not, so to speak, digital cameras that are digital to the point of that's all that it is. It allows you to put certain things in place and then continue working and forget about uh, anything other than the photograph. And for me, that's where I lean to being able to work with a 35mm equivalent lens and frame things in a certain way that I'm not worrying about anything falling off or being too wide. And yeah, I, it's my first time actually using the X100V and definitely jumped in the deep end with it. But I can definitely see as a backup or a primary camera when you're trying to keep a low profile, this would be, would be perfect. And uh, I'm surprised for something the size it is, the speed at which it handles and deals with focus. And uh, having already checked something out earlier once I shot sound check, just to see what the range is like, the, the images are, well, not what I would have expected, unparalleled, they're brilliant.